everybody to the road show this morning in the buzz brought to you by the comedy connection sometimes customer service reps can be much more frustrating than Anne Hathaway was in the interim and while it can be one of the most frustrating things we do in life there are some common mistakes that only make it worse that's right the first is going in hot or just being rude in general because in a study by life hacker it says that this is something many people do before even they start dialing the number they say it's important to remember the person on the other end of the line is only doing their job mm -hmm. another mistake I probably made is not being prepared <laughs> remember to have everything you need ready such as dates your account number, mm -hmm. uh, so that the process is easier and quicker. And the last thing is being completely unwilling to compromise. So for example, <laughs> I'm like, is he pointing at me? No, no, right here. Oh, maybe if you want a refund, but they offer you a credit, sometimes it just makes sense to just get out while you're ahead. Right. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I have a problem with all of those things. Um, <laughs> I, I don't think, like, I go in, I go in and I try to be very nice, yes. right? But I go in and I, I do, like, I'm coming in hot. So when you I, start off hot? I do. Oh, well, no, like the worst I, thing I, you can do. But I, but I try, I, look, I, I try to be nice, and then, but then I can feel it, like, coming yes, on. Yes, yes. You know, and, and if I don't get what I want, then I need to speak to somebody else, like, now. Now. And yeah. I don't want to be put on hold for 35 minutes, and yeah. I know it's bad, and I know it's not these people's fault. Right. Sometimes it is very difficult to hear the person on the other end. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they're not here in, you know, in this country. They're in a call center around the world. You know, there's always that delay that yep. you hear. It's hard to hear. Uh, and you can hear the other people in the call center in the background. And then they put me on hold, and you're like sitting listening to this music for 20 minutes. Yeah. Which yeah. only makes me matter. Which makes so then you start and I think hot they do and it on purpose. Hotter. I think they do it on purpose. <laughs> I think if I come in hot, they say, you know what we're going to do? Because I would have done this. If I was on the other end and, <laughs> I got me on, hot right now. and I got me on the phone, I would have said, fan you off. You know what we're going to do with this guy? Boop. Let him listen well, to Kenny G. For 20 minutes. For 20 minutes. Right, yeah, right. That's let them go. That's their let them cool down. Yes, yeah. yes. See, if my four sons were here, they would say to you, this is what mom does every time she gets on the phone with someone. She does this stupid, annoying laugh after she asks a question. So I'll be like, you know, you didn't happen to know that this was late, right? <laughs> <laughs> And they hate that. Right, yeah, My yeah. My sons are always like, we know that's when you're so mad at someone, is that mm -hmm. when you do that stupid laugh. Yeah. They don't necessarily call it stupid laugh, but I do. I, I, I try not to go in hot. Right. But then when someone starts being combative back, right. it's difficult for me yes. not to be combative back. Agreed. So, um, but, I, but I have to say, too, you have to be prepared. Because right. I can't, how many times you've been on a phone call and they're like, that's fine, ma'am, but like, what was the order number? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then if you don't have it, you're searching through your emails to try to find it. Right. And that's not their fault. No, I'm no, not no. prepared. No, no. Yeah. So. The other thing that drives me crazy quickly uh -oh. is, is not only if I, if I don't have my account number and then, you know, I've got my account number, right? <laughs> then they're like, can you tell us the secret code? I don't Ooh, know the secret like, code. What's your wife's middle name? Uh, what street do you live on when you were 10? I don't know the secret code, Brendan. <sighs> The code, please. Allow me to quote a little film by the name of Roadhouse, yes. in which a character named Dalton says, be nice until it's time not to be nice. That's it. <laughs> it's very difficult, it's though. Very when you're difficult. on the phone with these people, you know you don't have this kind of time. Yeah. Right. You just need an answer. Sometimes they're inaudible. You can't hear them. Correct. There's, you wanna, where are you? A tractor pull? Yes. Like, where are you taking this call from? I don't understand. A WWE event? I don't mm -hmm. know. And it, the frustration just builds and builds. Yeah. Yeah. And you just, calm. right. That's yeah. why I have to put myself in a zen-like state of mind, like those karate guys before they break the bricks, before right. I make these calls, because I know and yeah. remember, that's not, that's not their fault either. You well, know, they're just the middleman. You I know what, Audrey? Sometimes it is. <laughs> sometimes it is, Audrey. Sometimes I, it is. I, I Why are you sticking lining. up for it? I try to be the silver lining no. always. You're no, so, no. You're so right. And many times, it's not that. Pr and you have to <laughs> you have to make a verbal, you know, you got to qualify your statement by saying, I know it's not your fault, but right. let's get through this together. Let's check right. in with our viewers to see what you, some sage comments and wisdom and advice coming from our Roadshow viewers as they only can provide. Jeannie's up first. She says, be polite light but firm. Yes, this usually works for me. Also, go into the call with your facts straight. 
Yes, in the words of Bruce Springsteen, you got to get it straight. You can always ask for a supervisor. Yeah, you can't. Actually, you can do that. Take things to the next level. I wouldn't mess with Jean. I bet she gets right to, the, right to business. Tammy says, I worked in call centers for years, so I apologized first. That way, if I got heated, I had done my due diligence. Well, if she's a <laughs> that's not bad. James says, I'm usually very polite, but there have been times in the past when I have said a few choice words, which cannot be repeated well, here. Let's list the <laughs> And last but not least, Michelle, I love this comment. Representative, representative, representative. <laughs> exactly. That's the one right there. You're on the phone. Just say representative to get a representative. Representative. <laughs> Thanks for chiming in, everyone. And please keep those comments coming. They might be shown right here on the show. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And you never know, we might read your comment right here on the show. Stupid robot things never work either. Stupid.